Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. It is me, it is Katleo Malela. As always, thank you so much for choosing me over and over and over again. Today we have a really exciting video. I know you guys love it when I cook on my channel, when I'm always doing all these wonderful breakfasts and lunches and dinners. And I wanted to share with you some of my favorite cozy breakfasts that I love to eat. And I've been eating this on repeat especially given the fact that it's slightly chillier outside i love me a good sweet or savory breakfast each and every single day okay some of them are for the weekends i mean i guess you know some of them you need a little bit more time but let me tell you these are great great options one of the big things that i like to do is be sure of what i'm ingesting and know the properties and values of what i'm ingesting so anything that's with regards to fiber anything that promotes gut health i am there so i've got some things today that i'm going to show you that promote all of that i'm so so excited but before we get started with that I would like to thank today's sponsor. Yay! We've got a sponsor for today's video. Vodacom and YouTube have partnered up together to give us the deal of a lifetime. Let me tell you, as a content creator, one of the things that I always need to have is data. I don't know about you as the consumer, you know, you know in today's, in today's economy, data, okay? So Vodacom and YouTube have partnered up together to give us a great deal so that we can watch each other and watch our faves and keep in touch and stream galore, okay? Listen, so just for 99 rands only, you could get 15 gigs worth of data. Do you hear my chat? You have to be a Vodacom customer, obviously, to start, obviously. I mean, aren't we all? Okay, sure. just for 99 rands only, you can get 15 gigs worth of data. That's 10 gigs normal data plus 5 gigs YouTube data for free. Do you understand? Are you, are you listening? Are you listening, my doll? for free so all you would need to do is switch to prepaid lte to do that you would need to dial star one two three star zero one hash and you follow the prompts and basically it'll switch you to lte and then from there you buy the data so you know it's star one two three hash and then you follow the prompts basically you choose the five gig plus five gig data bundle and click select and then you'll receive a confirmation sms and then you have your 15 gigs worth of data 10 plus 5 just for youtube my darling for free yeah do you see how the people from vodacom and youtube they they understand they understand they get they get what we're going through yeah, Yvonne. So don't say I never told you. Don't say I never plugged you. It's a great deal so that we can watch each other, so that we can keep in touch, so that we can comment, so that we can listen. You can watch all these videos and no stress, stressless. Okay, so I just wanted to share that with you, girl. And also, I wanted to thank Vodacom for sponsoring today's video. So, let's get into the food. Let's make some food because, girl, my stomach is grumbling. Okay, and at this point, I am worried that you guys can hear me. Let's get into this video. Let's do it. Okay, the first breakfast option I'm going to be making is rolled oats. Yes, rich in fiber, very, very good for you, very, very good for gut health as well. I'm going to be making some rolled oats and a little bit. I'm, I'm, I'm going to pizzazz it. I'm going to jazz it up. So are you ready? Let's do it. Starting off with oats. This is one of my favorite, favorite breakfasts to make, especially in the winter time. It's warm, it's cozy, especially on days like this. If I'm not feeling the best, I love it. So it's one cup of oats, rolled oats, and one cup of milk. I like my oats with milk. I really do not like it with water. It's just more creamier with milk. It's really, really good with milk. Definitely try it with milk. And then I add a little bit of cinnamon. Oats, on the other hand, is really, really good for blood sugar regulation. It's got fiber. It's really, really good for your um, tummy area. Very, very good. So I definitely highly suggest oats. And then, of course, to just pizzazz it and jazz it up a little bit, I like to add strawberries, um, 
berries any kind of berries to my oats i absolutely love so this time around we did the strawberries and we did the blueberries while at the same time you always have to keep stirring keep watching the pot because you do not want it to burn that it typically takes about 15 to 20 minutes to do and then this is my absolute favorite part ah jazzing it up and dressing up my oats is one of my favorite parts of getting this meal together because this is just the most exciting part so i add the oats into my plate and then i jazz it up with the fruits and i add a little bit of more cinnamon if i want to dependent on the taste and all of that but i just typically like it with fruits because it adds that sweetness and berries are really great for gut health and antioxidants as well so oof it's one of my favorite 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 meals and then i add a little bit of peanut butter it can be peanut butter it can be almond butter whichever you feel is best for you i love it because it's healthy fats and it's really really good for you as well so definitely one of my favorite favorite breakfast options especially in the winter time Breakfast number two is one of my favorites. I absolutely love it so much, especially over the weekend. It reminds me of my mom. Growing up, my mom used to make uh, breakfast for me and my sister, and it would always be French toast, especially over the weekends. I absolutely love it. So we know how French toast is done. I mean, come on. Two eggs, which is really great in aiding with protein. If you are somebody that doesn't have too much protein, in terms of meat eggs is your next best option okay so i often add a little bit of milk to the eggs and then after that i add a little bit of seasoning i love black pepper and a little bit of salt to the eggs just so that we give it a little bit of flavor i absolutely love it and then i will add as well a little bit more of the cinnamon i think cinnamon goes so so well with eggs and i just stir it up a little bit more there we go that, that there's that cinnamon girl there's that cinnamon girl stir it up a little bit more and then prepare my bread to add it into the pan so typically i will add a little bit of oil to the pan and then i will add my bread now with the bread low gi bread is my favorite bread it's great because again high fiber content but also at the same time it is really really good in slowing down your digestion so typically you will feel fuller for longer if you take low gi bread as opposed to any other bread so you stay full and satiated for a much longer period so you don't feel the constant need to be eating or snacking and my favorite one this one has cranberry bits in it so it's got a little bit of sweetness as well so as much as the egg is a little bit salty and all of that but the bread itself has a little bit of sweetness and i love that i love a little bit of mix of sweet and salty oh mm, it's really really great so i prepare my french toast over the stove top and i wait for it to cook up it takes usually about maybe just under 10 minutes to do and then after that i plate as i always say plating is my favorite portion favorite part <laughs> of dishing out my food so I plate it and again as always fruits definitely you cannot have french toast without maple syrup or honey this time around I was using honey so I'll put down one slice drizzle it with honey put down the second drizzle it with honey put down the third and drizzle it with honey and it's just so delicious it adds that little bit of sweetness as well not too much though let's not get 
crazy, okay? I, I, I went a little bit overboard, okay? But I love it so much. And then, of course, I bedazzle, okay, the meal with more fruits. Fruits are really great. They just add a little bit of flavor to an otherwise very basic breakfast. So definitely love, love me some French toast, especially over the weekends. Now, for you savory breakfast lovers, I got you. We got a little bit of ever on toast with a little bit of a twist. So this one definitely needs the weekend. You need time, a little bit more time to prepare this one. But I really, really enjoy this one. Starting off with cutting up the spring onions. I love spring onions. I love to add it to my eggs. I add it to my noodles. I add it to pretty much everything. Followed by me chopping up the streaky bacon. I love bacon. I don't think there's anyone who doesn't like bacon, right? Unless you don't eat meat. But you, you know what I'm saying. You add the streaky bacon to your pan. Do not add oil when you are cooking bacon. You don't need to because it's fatty as it is. So it's just going to release its own oil. So you do not have, you see, you can see it there in the pan. You see? So you do not need to. So after I've cooked it up for two to three minutes, I remove it. I clean the pan, I add a little bit of oil, and then I add one egg because there's so much going on in this breakfast, you do not need more than one egg, girl, okay, no. And then I plate up, again, my favorite process. I add some avo to my toast. I've toasted up the bread. Again, it's the cranberry low GI bread, and then I add the avo to the toast. From there, I will then follow with the bacon. You drizzle. You just add. You see, it's already coming together. It's it's looking very gourmet. You know, it's very it's looking very gourmet, right? And then you add <laughs> the tomatoes because that promotes a lot of um, gut health. It's really good as well for the brain and heart. Tomatoes. Did you know that? Nope. After that, I add the egg and then I sprinkle on the spring onion on top. Flavor it. Season. Add some pepper. Add some salt. And that's pretty much it. And there you have it. That is my cozy, my breakfast, my current favorite breakfast that I absolutely love so much. First up, we've got the oats, which I really do enjoy. I love it so, so, so much. Trust me, there'll be people to eat this food. I know you guys are already thinking some things. <laughs> it's okay. Um, and the next one is French toast. French toast is just... It's so nostalgic and it's just so enjoyable that I really, really love it, especially over the weekend where I have time to film. I really, really, where I have time to make a long breakfast. I really love me a good French toast. And for something savory, which you can top up with sriracha, I have this Evo on toast, but with a little bit, you know, it's, it's avant-garde. <laughs> No, it's ever with toast with a little bit extra other things that you can add that suits your taste buds. And then you can just dash it over with a little bit of sriracha. I love it so much. So if you guys want to continue watching my videos, streaming with me, definitely take advantage of the 99 Rand deal provided by Vodacom and YouTube. They did it for us. They definitely did it for us. Well, I'm going to go. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a like, subscribe. And thank you so much to Vodacom and YouTube for sponsoring this video. Until the next one, I'll see you very, very soon. Sayonara.